All right, so today for Cardinal Fast Five, uh, we're continuing with Black History Month, and I'm fired up to have uh, uh, one of our alums, Kamani Turner, who I had the uh, distinct pleasure of coaching. So Kamani is a recent alum. I won't, uh, you know, steal his thunder, but welcome welcome to Cardinal Fast Five, Kamani. Thanks for having me, Coach Gut, man. It means a lot. Yeah, glad to do it, man. All right, well, let's let's jump right into it. Let's start with question number one. So how did you choose Catholic U? Um, I chose Catholic U mostly because it was a program that wanted me to come and play like from the very beginning. All the coaches loved me from the moment I came in. Um, and most importantly, when I first came in for my visit, it was just sort of like I felt like they would really take me in as a family. Like from the very beginning, like as soon as I got to the school, right in the prayers, everybody was like, yo, we're all family. It's a band of brothers. And it's kind of just something that I look forward to, something like college football, because like that's kind of like the experience I had in high school. I didn't want to really go somewhere where it was more so like clicked up and everybody was just doing their own thing here at Catholic. It's big on family. Everybody's one big family. You know, we ride together. And that's it. Yeah, man, that's that's been the Catholic U, uh, you know, MO for a long time is is that it, it is a band of brothers and we're all in this together. Even, even the guys, that, you know, from the older years, when I talked to them, they uh, they remember how tight they were with each other. And that's that's what makes it special. So. Okay, so what position? Now I know what position you play, but I'm asking you anyway. What position did you play at Catholic, and what were those years? Uh, I played uh, outside linebacker, and I kind of played like a hybrid safety position. Um, I played from 2016 through what was that 2020, and I graduated this past this past uh, May. <laughs> yeah, and didn't get to have a commencement ceremony, you know, but uh, you, yeah. you did a great job finishing on time, and it was awesome. So, so tell me, what did you major in when you were at Catholic? Uh, while I was here, I uh, majored in business management. Mm -hmm. And did you have any internships or anything like that? Yeah, I actually had an internship with uh, someone who uh, played Catholic football. It's called Infinitive Inc. And that was actually really cool. And just being able to like bond and like relate to like different Catholic related things that like everyone else in the office couldn't really relate to and just talk about yep. different things. That was pretty so that, that was Dennis McFarland, right? Yeah. All right. Well, shout out to Dennis. So yeah, he, that was awesome. Yeah. But that's that Catholic U network, man. It's, it's awesome. It's really tight. Yeah. Yep. Okay. So tell me, what are you doing now? Uh, right now I'm an unemployment uh, support analyst and basically I'm just helping like all the New Yorkers kind of get their unemployment thing together right now. Cause it's kind of a mess right now, you know, cause oh, man, is it a mess <laughs> everything going on right now? Yeah. Well, hopefully we're coming to the tail end of this thing and, and, uh, they can, you know, we can get more people back to work. It looks like things are looking up for the summer. So I can't wait. I can't wait either, man. I'm really looking yeah. forward to you guys getting back out there and seeing the videos and everyone getting back to it. Yes, sir. Yeah. Okay. So what's your favorite memory from your time at Catholic U? And it has to be one that you don't mind sharing with the public. <laughs> uh, I'm not even going to lie. This might sound that cheesy. But I think my favorite memory is probably senior day, my senior year. I don't know. I felt like I was just really happy to see, like, there was only, like, a hit, like maybe, like, seven seniors. But it just felt really good that all the underclassmen were really kind of bought in and made sure that our last game was, you know, our last home game was went out on a win. And that just meant a lot to me. Yeah. No, your guys' class really, it was a small class. And, and the ones that hung in there um, have really helped, you know, change the culture. And we're going to see that fruit coming soon. So, you know, we were like the – the last few hardcore guys. Definitely, definitely remember yeah. that. Yeah, good deal. Well, that's awesome. Well, Kamani, thanks so much for, for doing this. It's awesome to catch up with you. And uh, we'll get you back on campus soon, I hope. Thanks for having me, man. Anytime. All right. Cards, you already know. <laughs> good deal. All right, I'll talk to you soon, Kamani. All right, talk to you soon. All right. <laughs>